thinking and learning is some of the most important work a leader does, even if it doesn't feel like work. You are often encouraged to invest all your time speaking with others and reading reports. I would certainly agree that listening to people throughout all levels of your organization and those outside of it is indispensable. So too is knowing the current and expected conditions of key variables in your company's performance and the industries you serve. But if that is all you find yourself doing, it's time for some change. The most effective leaders I have worked with have plenty of available time, and they use much of it to learn and think. How can they do that? By building a solid team, by providing clear leadership and expectations, and by encouraging people to make decisions they're capable of making. Whatever process you decide would work for you and your organization is just fine. You simply can't put it off any longer. If you're not thinking and learning, your organization is slipping. And I know you don't want that. But you're not the only one who needs time to think and to learn. You have not a single employee who doesn't need those same things. Why? Because how can we expect them to be interested, engaged, and to grow if every minute is filled with doing the same repetitive work? In a downturn, often the first financial cut is training. That means you don't believe it to be effective or you would continue the investment. So why are you supporting training in good times? An important aspect of effective leadership is building a learning organization. An organization that doesn't learn can't be healthy. So how do you start to build a learning organization? With yourself. You prioritize it. You continue the priority when a downturn hits. You expect the same of employees and you sure that they know that and have the required support. If you and your employees are too busy to think and to learn, you're simply busy. You're not productive. Does your calendar include untouchable time for thinking? Does it include untouchable time for taking opportunities to learn? Does it include sharing those thoughts and those lessons with others? If not, Make that change now. It's the most important work you will do today.